Now, we're going to go to the mysterious death of a former Tampa Bay Buccaneers player just a, over a week after the team's Super Bowl win. An investigation is underway at the retired star Vincent Jackson was found dead at a Florida hotel. Janae Norman joins us with the latest. Good morning, Janae. Michael, good morning. Yeah, he was drafted in 2005, played seven years with the San Diego Chargers before signing with the Tampa Bay Bucks in 2012. The local sheriff's office named Vincent Jackson an honorary deputy three years ago for his service and commitment to the community. Now deputies from the same sheriff's office are investigating how the 38 year old father suddenly died. Freeman fires. It is caught. Touchdown, Vincent Jackson. This morning, police investigating the death of retired Tampa Bay Buccaneer Vincent Jackson. Only a week after his former team Super Bowl win, the three-time Pro Bowl wide receiver found dead at this hotel near Tampa. He was just amazing, and he just loved our loved our community the same way that we do. The cause of death is unknown, but police say there were no signs of trauma. Jackson's family had reported him missing one month earlier, leading police to visit Jackson at the hotel on February 11th, where they confirmed his well-being. On Monday morning, hotel staff found the ex-NFL player dead. Many mourning the loss on social media. The Buccaneers saying during his five seasons with our franchise, Vincent was a consummate professional who took a great deal of pride in his performance on and off the football field. Jackson retired in 2016 and turned his attention to giving back, founding his own charity and devoting himself to a cause close to his heart, military families and children. It's something I grew up in being in a military household as a kid and uh, traveling around and knowing the, the nuances and the, the obstacles that military families face. So it's important to know that, you know, those kids can kind of be specialized and, and maybe get their own specific scholarship. There were so many other worthwhile causes he could have chosen that were more um, glamorous, I guess you could say, and he picked military kids. And I just, sorry, I just feel like for me, that just speaks volumes of what a kind person he was. His family telling ABC News, we are all mourning the loss of our beloved Vincent. His wife and family ask that everyone respect their privacy at this time. And with the cause of death still unknown, a toxicology report is expected in six to eight weeks. In a statement, the Chargers describing Jackson as a fan favorite, the Hillsborough, Hillsborough County Sheriff calling him a devoted man who put his family and community above everything else. George. That's such a tragedy. Okay, Janae, thank you very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.